KSL's groundbreaking true crime podcast, Cold, continues to reveal new details about the search for Susan Powell. This week, a chilling warning given to her father in law by an FBI agent years before Josh Powell murdered his two sons, and the case went cold. What if one of the kids starts saying something? Saying something like You what? know, like uh, coming out with information that, that he didn't come out with before. What's Josh going to do? Well, he loves his kids. You know, you might think he'd never do anything to his kids, but if something's broken, maybe he would. I'm not sure I understand where you're getting at because if uh, you would kill saying, his wife oh, because he's got something oh, broken you're inside of him, kill his kids. He might. You know? Do, you, do we know that? I know you're just saying, oh, he'd never do that. But I don't think so. But not. I don't. Would think you have said that about the wife? Stephen Powell became a central character in the Susan Powell saga in the years after she disappeared. And once again, the focus of this week's podcast. Investigative reporter and cold host Dave Colley traveled to Seattle to learn more about the man, his music, and his mixed messages about what he thought happened to his daughter-in-law. And strike a pose like a chicken strutting to the block. Steve Powell fancied himself a musician. He spent several thousand dollars building a home studio and hoped his song, Light of Seattle would be the song about the city of Seattle. The light of Seattle is you. Unfortunately, he's now more known for titles like I Only Feel Love, which was about Susan. I only feel love when I'm with or without you. You can hear Susan Powell's voice singing background on a number of Steve Powell's songs. He kept a list on his computer of more than 50 titles inspired by Susan. I can love you in a secret way. As we've learned, Steve's obsession with Susan went far beyond secret love songs. And his infatuation with her bewildered investigators from their very first interaction. He starts talking about Susan and his electricity between them. And he just went off on, you know, not the normal, oh yeah, my, my, daughter-in-law went missing and you know I'm, I'm helping I want to know where she is and stuff like that he went into his relationship with her and it went a totally different route in later interviews the FBI pressed Steve for any information Josh might have given him about what happened to Susan but that didn't get them far if you knew Josh did something or he told you something would you come forward and tell us I'm not sure I would Steve Powell had many more shocking things to say during his roughly three-hour chat with the FBI, including what he believed Susan was capable of doing to Josh. You can hear that and much more in Cold Episode 9, available now wherever you get your podcasts at thecoldpodcast.com or at ksltv.com.